Hey guys, my name is Thomas Semek. Uh, I'm the chief mechanic on the number 15 car here at Ray Hall Letterman Lanigan Racing. And welcome back to Tech Tuesday. This week we're gonna talk a little bit about how we load the trailers with the cars and equipment. Welcome back to the transporter. This is where we keep all of our equipment uh, during the race weekend. The trailer is spacious to work. We have various uh, benches to work on, the gearbox department, electronics, but when we pack everything up, every square inch of this is used up. Some of you wonder, how do we do it? How do we get everything in the trailer and where does it all go? On this segment of Tech Tuesday, I'll give you a look-see on how we do that. Beginning the most important thing with the race car, that's going to be in the upper level. In fact, there are going to be two race cars up here. There's going to be a spare car up towards the front and then a spare car towards the tail end of the trailer. That's the one that we'll use on the race weekend. While we fill up this transporter, the center aisle is going to be filled with various equipment. Uh, some of the units that we put in here will be the crew toolboxes. Those will get stuffed in uh, various parking spots underneath the counter for uh, quick uh, access and uh, efficient use of space. Uh, there's various equipment that we put on the transporter. Some are large module units that are easily stowable, and then some are uh, smaller items that we tuck in and out of the different cabinets. But the center aisle is where the magic happens. We're going to put uh, various equipment, and this equipment is specially designed to fit this transporter. The first thing that will go in is the fuel systems unit, or what we call the fuel rig. And then followed behind that, onto the right, is what we call our garage box under the canopy that holds all of our uh, setup equipment and things, uh, instruments used for the race car. After that would be the timing stand. After the timing stand, we're going to add the tugger unit. And then after that is the wheel cart. The reason why the wheel cart is last to be on the truck, that's the first thing that you're going to use when you go to the uh, circuit to get the wheels mounted. So here at the race shop, with a team of people, it could take us as little as 30 minutes to load this trailer from top to bottom. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tech Tuesday. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.